another claustrophobic cobweb filled section. Just another day. Resident Evil 7. You know how it is. Hello and welcome to another episode of Game On. I'm Slash Raptor and this is Resident Evil 7 here in the fifth episode. In the last episode, we found the second head that we need for the Cerberus lock that's hopefully going to get us out of this house. And we also found a videotape of Mia who was being chased by, I think her name's Marguerite. And there, then she got caught. That was about it. And, uh, yeah. So I think we have to go through here because I'm pretty sure this is the only door we haven't been through yet. Or at least the ones that, you know, we, we can go through. And I also mentioned in the previous episode that after doing the third episode, I, dis I saw online that you can actually have Jack cut off your part of your leg, and I thought that was hilarious, so I decided to start, the start from the beginning and see if I could make it happen, and I did, which is why the wall downstairs is destroyed. So this is technically my second time, but I didn't get to this point before, so I just did the first couple minutes again, and... Yeah, he cuts off your leg, and it was pretty creepy and funny. But Jack is... So far, he's gone. I don't know if he's gone for sure, but he hasn't been around for a little while. So that's probably a good sign. Handgun ammo. Anything in here? Oh, an antique coin! I don't think I want that, because it's been in the toilet. Oh, God! Wait, what's this black crap? Oh, I can drain it! Ew! 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 Hey, a wooden statuette. Ah, this must be what we need to open up that projection room in the other place. Is this the same black crap that was on Mia's driver's license when we first found it? It's a disgusting mess of God knows what. It's a pretty good way to describe it. Okay, so let's go use this thing then. What the? Oh my God! Speak of the devil. Okay, well, every time we meet him, he has a new weapon. Since he probably can't die, there's not much point in fighting him. I don't think I should waste my ammo on him, because he's probably just going to keep following us. He, he's like that thing that I can't remember the name of from Dead Space. Okay, so now we can probably put this on here, and so we had to rotate it until it takes on this shape. Oh, wait, wait, I think it's a bird. Like this, maybe? Like this? No. Like this? Yay, we did it! Now where's this gonna lead? Hey, who does build this? Another claustrophobic cobweb filled section. Just another day. Resident Evil 7. You know how it is. I'm actually not claustrophobic. I'm actually the opposite. I think they call it agoraphobic, but I thought that meant being afraid of going outside. And I'm not afraid of going outside. I just don't like huge buildings. Because it feels like I'm about to be eaten by them. It took me a long time to be able to actually shop at Costco, because it's so huge. Whoa, did you guys see those cans? They just, like, attacked me. Is there a ghost in here? Strong, what was it? A strong first aid kit. Ooh, there's a weapon in there. How do we open that door? There's a crow on the door. Okay. Whoa, what was that? Did you guys hear that? We, we, we must need three different kinds of keys, then. Because this one is a two-headed crow. Uh, then there was also the scorpion door. And then there was also the snake door, I think. Uh, handgun ammo. What's in this fridge? Oh, some chem fluid. See, now this actually looks like a regular place. It's not disgusting food. It's actually pretty good looking. Looks like it was a lasagna or something. Is there a secret passage in this fireplace? No, I think that's just a regular fireplace. What's this? Handgun ammo. Hey, buddy. How's it going? 
you, uh, would it bother you if I cut off the antlers and use them as a weapon? Because they're pretty sharp. I'm just gonna... Oh, I can't. What kind of a survival horror game doesn't let you improvise like that? These things are lethal. What is through here? Uh... What was that sound? Oh, I need a lockpick for that. Well, the last time I looked at one of these, I got a lockpick. Maybe I'll get another one from this. Uh... Oh! Gross! Bugs! Gunpowder. I saw the little symbol come up. Wait, what's this? Oh, an antique coin. Sitting in a cigarette... tray. Looks like a kid drew it. Mia. With a bunch of butterflies around her. June 14th. Vacationing husband and wife. The husband was a success. He's the 12th. Unfortunately, the wife was no good, so we'll just get rid of her. July 7th. Three college girls. They're all rotten. Lucas is a damn idiot. August 13th. Homeless man. Turned in three days. He's the 13th. What the hell is going on in this place? Ew. What is this black stuff? This is gross. What? Whoa! What the hell? Ah! 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 No! No! Stay away from me! Ow! Ow! Oh! God! What the hell was that thing? It just came out of the wall! Oh, God. I really don't want to go in here, then. Ah. Oh, there's more of this stuff. Oh, there's more of it. Oh, God. I don't like this at all. What is this stuff? So, does this mean that, like, any wall could potentially be of... Whatever the hell that thing was? Can I, like, shoot it in advance to make sure it doesn't turn into that? No, I think I just wasted two shots. What is this stuff? Okay, so that's another scorpion door. Can't go there. What's in here? Oh, it's a safe room. Okay, cool. Handgun ammo. Dear Courtney, those bastards are looking for me. But maybe this gives you a chance to escape. To escape, you have to find the reliefs shaped like dog heads. I saw one of the heads in the, in, in the dissection room underground. Get it. It's the key out of here. Okay. Um, what do I have here? Handgun ammo. Probably good for this. I don't know what these coins do, so I'm gonna hang on to those. I don't need this strong first aid kit right now. Um. Let's make a few more healing things. Oh, I need to heal. Actually, maybe what I can do is I can use this strong first aid med. Why is he only pouring it on his hand? How is that supposed to heal everything? Okay, so now we should make one thing of this, and another healing thing. And now we'll put this in here, and we'll put this in here, and then this can go in there. And we'll save it.
guess we have to go down there. I really don't want to go down there. I'm just getting that bad vibe. This is a bad idea. It's gonna be dark, and there's gonna be those creepy things on the wall. I don't like this one bit. Oh god! Oh god. Are they gonna come after me? I don't like this. I really don't like this. I don't like this at all. There's these weird squelching noises. I can't tell if that means things are gonna... Oh, I can't go that way. Fantastic. So that means I have to go over here. Can I close this door? No? Ha! No, stay back. Stay back. You freak. Stay away from me. Oh, I think I shot its head off. What the hell are these things? I really don't like this. I really don't like this. I want to go home. 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 Oh, it's locked from the other side. What does this do? Can I open this? I look like Frankenstein with these st stitches or staples in my wrist. Is there gonna be anything coming to life from here? What is that sound? Wait, there's a symbol there. What? Oh, it's an antique coin. It's a good thing. I, it's a good thing that little thing was there. I wouldn't have seen that at all. I don't know what these things do yet, but I would imagine we're going to figure it out pretty soon. Processing area map, okay. Uh, herb. I want everybody say about the herb. Herb, 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 herb. herb herb's a word, I want an herb, herb, herb. Herb is a word, I want an herb, 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 herb. Oh. Okay, unlock it. Wait, this just leads back to the entrance, okay. So I guess that was the first one that we tried. So now we know where that leads. Um, what's over here? Lockpick. Treasure photo. Hey, wait, that's the fireplace that we saw. That was That's in the same place with the deer. I knew there was going to be something in the fireplace, because the last one had something special in it. What's this? The scorpion key. That must be how you open doors with scorpions on them. Oh, God! Where did you come from? Stop it. Ow! Gotta aim for their heads. I think that's their weak spot. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> hey guys, I figured it out. Without their heads, they're powerless. Bonus points if you get that reference. Chem fluid. Okay. So, it looks like that was what we needed. So, oh, there's other doors in here too. Um, what, what's this one? Oh, this leads in there. I don't want to deal with that yet. First, let's go see if we can get the shotgun. Because I think that's what the thing was. There was that, there was that lock on there. And there's a lock pick that we have, so let's open this. Because I remember it was locked. Oh, it's just handgun ammo. Probably should have saved that for something better. So, uh, I don't think we'll need this herb right now. We're not going to need this. And I don't need this. So, let's... How am I doing for health? I think I'm okay. Okay, so let's go use this scorpion key. Not to be confused with the scorpion king. And we'll open this door and see where this leads. Open! 
Oh, it just leads back here. Okay. So now we have to figure out where that other one was. Oh, I don't like this at all. I don't like this part. Anything that has those black gunk things in it could potentially come out. Alright, so yeah, this is the fireplace. So what, what do we do with this treasure photo? I hid something nice here. Try to find it if you can. So now what do I do? Do I just go over here? Oh. I found the treasure! Steroids? What do steroids do? Besides make your penis smaller. Dramatically strengthens muscles and increases max health. Oh, so that's a power-up. Okay, so in this game, it's a health increase. Alright then, I guess we're gonna do some roids. <sighs> oh yeah, that's the stuff! Power thirst! Your max health increased. Yes! And my penis size decreased. No! Alright, so I guess we want to go this way? No, this isn't the right way. That's the long way around. I think we can also get there by going through here. And then here. And then over here. Please don't have there be any more of those black things. Whatever those are called, I don't like them. I really don't want to have to deal with them again. Okay, so now we can go up here. Oh, she's gone. She was here the last time I came through this place. So that's the snake door. We can't open that yet. And then it was in here. Uh, scorpion key. How is he gonna go away? I don't want him in here. Where is he? I'm not a pig, you're a pig. Shut up. I kinda want some bacon now, though. Even any of this area? How come you're. Uh, dear Mrs. Baker, how have you been feeling recently? It's been a long time since you came in for your last checkup. I'm writing to tell you that I've finished examining your x ray. Those dark areas in your cranium are fungus like structures that seem to be related to mold. The hallucinations and noises you said you've been hearing may be related to those growths. If your symptoms are due to a fungal parasite, it must be removed before it's too late. I don't mean to scare you, but I'm seriously concerned for your health. Please come to the hospital as soon as you read this letter. As your doctor, I strongly recommend you undergo further tests. Where is he? Peekaboo! Get out of here, Jack! I want the shotgun, and you're not taking it away from me. Ow! What did you hit me with, you freak? Okay, he's dead, for now. That won't last. He's down, I guess I should say. Not dead. Ew! I don't want those. No, put those down. What does this do? I'm tired of chasing all these shitheads around the yard. The next time one of our guests runs away, hide the dog head relief so they can't get out of the house. The living room grandfather clock, the book in the recreation room, and the dissection room in the basement. Okay, so we have everything except the one in the dissection room basement. And then there's some chem fluid in here. And some shotgun shells. And then there's nothing in here. So I guess all we have to do now is grab the shotgun. But it is broken. So let's take this. And we're gonna go over here. So now I guess we take this. Right, so now I guess we put the other shotgun, because it's broken and can't be used, in here. 
And now just like that, we've got ourselves a fancy shotgun. Hooray! So now let's leave before Jack comes to and decides he wants to have a piece of us. I don't want to deal with him right now. I don't want to deal with him ever. He's annoying. And he hits me with garden utensils, it looks like. I think you know he has a, like one of those handheld rototillers. I don't know what they're called, but they, they look like those those paint rollers, except it has spikes on it. And I guess you would use it in the garden to make soil nice and soft, maybe? Okay, so I don't know if we really need this treasure photo anymore, because I'm pretty sure we found the treasure for it. And I don't think we need this key anymore, because I think we opened all the scorpion doors that we can get to at this point. Um, I guess we might as well keep the shotgun around, though. Because it might still be useful later on. I'm gonna reload. I've only got three shots, so I'll have to make them count. My ears are itchy. Okay, so now I want to have the shotgun out just because it's cool. I don't want to shoot anything with it because I've only got th three shots, but I'll, at the very least I'll put it out. Okay, so we still need that one more head. Do I have to re-unlock re re this? Or does it stay unlocked? No, it stays unlocked. Okay, great. Fantastic. So now that means we have to go down here again and start looking for that other Cerberus head. Please don't let there be any monsters down here. I don't like monsters. Please don't let there be any monsters down here. It's just a game. It's just a game. Nothing to be afraid of. It's just a game. It's just a game. Nothing's gonna get me. Nothing's gonna get me. Let's go in here. And what do we have here? Strong chem fluid. Okay. What's this? Lucas, I caught the guy who keeps trying to escape. Is that me? I've locked him up in the leftmost incinerator so he can't get away again. Take him out when he's ready. You, rem you know how to open the door, don't you? Just remember, three A's and a handprint. Do what you want with his girl. That can't be me because I'm not in the incinerator. Why is that here? There's nothing in there. Ah! Where is it? Where is it? Ah! Headshot. 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 Okay, it's dead. Another one down. Gunpowder. Nice. You can make more ammo with that. What is that sound? I keep hearing this weird squelching noise. Oh wait, red handprint. No, wait, but it said three A's. Travis. Lara, that's two. Craig, that's one A. William has one A. Sean has one A. Well, none of them have three A's. But this one doesn't have a name on it at all. So, maybe it's this one? Because there's nothing under here. I guess we'll see what happens if I open this. Ah, Tamara. Okay, cool. So that has three A's. And then what was it? Three A's and then the red handprint? So, like this? Did I, did I solve it? Ah! Die! 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 Ow! Stop it, stupid monsters! Die! Die! Man, that took more than a couple headshots. I used a lot of ammo there. Jeez. Whatever those things are, they do not like being shot at in the in in general. They really don't like being shot at in their head. See, like, why is this here though? There's nothing in there. Alright, so that's the dissection room key. But now I used up so much ammo that I gotta go back and get more. So I guess this way. And then I also got those 
that uh, strong thing or whatever it's called, the strong chem fluid. So that probably lets me make more bullets in, in with one gunpowder because the thing is stronger. Oh, no, it's enhanced gun handgun ammo. It's packed with extra gunpowder, making it more powerful. But why is it more powerful? Because it's packed with more gunpowder, when technically it's packed with more chem fluid. Um... Actually, I think I'll save this, because this will probably be more use- wait, no. I'll take one of my herbs, and then I'll make a full healing thing. Because the full healing is probably going to be more useful overall than uh, this thing here. No, no, I did- oh, okay, well I did need a little bit of health, so. Combine with this. Oh, you can also do it here. Okay, I forgot about this menu, though. Alright, so the strong healing can go in here. This we'll need later on. And let's get more handgun ammo. And another five. Reload the gun. And then this... Oh, this can all... Oh, this... Yeah, this just here. And then there was the chem fluid. And now we can make more like this. And then put this in here, like that. And then we'll save it. Anyway folks, that's all the time I have for this episode of Game On. Thank you for joining me, and I hope to see you right back here in the very near future, where we will continue to play more Resident Evil 7. And until next time, peace out, and as always, Game On. See ya!